On June 30th this year, millions of protesters flooded back into Tahrir Square, begging the army to come back and overthrow Morsi. The protesters accused the Muslim Brotherhood of trying to grab too much power, of stoking sectarian tensions and destroying Egypt's economy. Another violent day in Egypt. More clashes between security forces and protesters. It certainly is very tense because, you know, the uh, different ingredients that are here are, are, are very dangerous. Ones. Breaking news out of Egypt. Here is a live look at Tahrir Square in Cairo. You've got security forces now saying that 650 people have been arrested during the clashes that left more than 50 people dead. Defense Minister General Abdel Fattah el-Sisi promptly made a speech giving Morsi 48 hours to listen to their demands. Or else. On the night of July 2nd, 16 people, mostly Morsi supporters, were killed in bloody clashes at Cairo University. So what was going on? Was it a coup? A revolution? Or the beginning of a civil war? As the countdown to the end of the ultimatum ticked down, we went to Cairo to find out.